Hello everyone, this is Tony Holden with eXp Realty. Welcome to my episode of American Dream. So a little history about John's Pass. John's Pass was named after a famous pirate. John was the first person to actually sail through after a hurricane in 1948, divided what is known as Madeira Beach and Treasure Island in half before the pass was never there. So the locals, we just call it the pass. And it's named after John Levick, the very first person to ever sail through. John hid his treasure on Madeira Beach. And when he came back after the hurricane, he couldn't find it. So he lived out the rest of his days here in Madeira Beach, looking for his treasure by night, fishing by day. And he lived long enough to see it become a famous fishing village in late 1800s. Hello everyone, we're here at Madeira Bay Marina. We're at the Mad Beach Fish House with Shirley, who is the dock master and the yacht salesman for the area. We're gonna ask Shirley a few questions about what she really loves about living in Florida. What does the Florida lifestyle mean to you, Shirley? It means boating and fishing and families and resorts and fun. We're back on my boat and we're about to head out uh, from Madeira Beach, run up John's Pass, take the Intercoastal up to Caddy's. So while we're on the water here at Indian Shores and Indian Rocks Beach, I want to take just a few moments to talk to you about uh, the market here on the water. Uh, in this particular area, there's about 132 homes for sale right now and there's about 118 days worth of inventory. So there's about 80 homes that have sold in the last 90 days. And with only with 132, you can see the market gets really tight. Now, a really interesting point about that is that about 50% of those people buying homes today in this market are using cash. What a great boat ride that was up the Intercoaster. We're now here at Caddy's. Let's go inside. I want to show you one of my favorite places to eat here on the Great Intercoastal here. So we're here with Bill at Caddy's. Uh, and so I'm just going to ask Bill, hey, Bill's general manager. Yeah. And so tell me, what's, uh, tell me what's unique about Caddy's. Caddy's is a fantastic waterfront destination for everybody. And the best part about it is you can come by car or as you did, come by boat. That's the best part. <laughs> and the food is phenomenal. Absolutely. And guys, when you walk across the street right here, you're right there on the beach or you're right here on the intercoastal. Come and enjoy the sunshine and the food. We're about to go in and have some food. We're gonna have a great time. It's <laughs> gonna be delicious. So this is our last stop on our episode here at Caddy's and the buffalo shrimp like I promised you with a homemade blue cheese dressing, gotta try it. Their mojito, one of the best on the beach and their group of Reuben. Absolutely one of my favorites. It's basically a Reuben sandwich with a uh, black grouper in it. Unbelievable, gotta try it. Come see us next time on the next episode of American Dream.